Lisa Nandy's car crash interview with Piers Morgan on Good Morning Britain has been branded career-ending by some viewers. The Labour leader candidate was grilled by the GMB host on a number of topics from Labour's stance on gender self-identification to public advice on the coronavirus. Nandy was accused of failing to give a straight answer on gender self-identification after Morgan asked whether those born biologically into one sex shouldn't be allowed to compete in the other's sports. I don't think I was the one doing the bullying. HTTPS colon slash slash t dot go slash sjkhgnlct0. Morgan said that males who identified as transgender had an advantage over females when it came to competing in sport, but Nandy accused Piers Morgan of setting up a false war between women and those who are transgender. The GMB host hit back stating that he was not creating such a conflict, but rather trying to get a leader to answer a question on a matter than many considered important. However, Nandy stated that a commission would need to be set up in order to truly define the answer and would not be drawn into an answer saying that's why I said to you we need to set up a commission to properly. The GMB host hit back at the MP for refusing to give a straight answer when it came to Labour's stance on gender self-identification rather than a consultation that Nandy suggested. The host of the ITV show also accused Nandy of being rash attending the interview when displaying cold symptoms and asked the Labour leader hopeful whether she had been tested for coronavirus. He said, you haven't got a cold, have you? Have you been tested with coronavirus? How to blow the Labour leadership in one interview at Lisa Nandy. Ms Nandy insisted she was not yet tested saying, I'm all right. I'm coronavirus free, I've just got Labour leadership hiters. At least Nandy just saw that car crash of an interview on GMB. I thought you were the sensible one. Looks like I got it wrong. Labour really are finished. The answer, however, did not appease Mr Morgan who hit back, you've got a cold. Do we just take your word for it? Susanna Reid also questioned the decision, suggesting that her decision to appear on the show demonstrated how difficult it would be for the government to keep Britons at home should there be a need to impose a widespread quarantine. She said, we're laughing about it now, but yesterday the government said that within 10 to 14 days the official advice will be, even if you have a mild cold, you're going to be asked to self-isolate. The fact you are here today, and obviously that's not official advice yet, is an indication that's going to be really difficult. Lisa Nandy on GMB turned into a woke snowflake adamantly refusing to give a straight answer to any question and as usual accused peers of gender bias for more on this story. Visit the news article link.